now we are doing exercise 6.3 question number four question number four let me write down the question question says if a now here is our question let us try to understand the question question says if a transversal line so let me draw first let me draw two parallel lines so let us draw two parallel lines so this is one parallel lines and another parallel lines let's draw this one and there is if a transversal can you see the question here if a transversal intersect any two parallel lines so there is a transversal there is a transversal which intersect these two parallel lines so let me draw the transversal like this so this is a transversal which intersect these two parallel lines so that i need to show that the bisector of any pair of alternate angles so what are the alternate angles here this angle and this angle are alternate this angles and this angles are alternate so take the bisector of any two angles okay so let me take the alternate angles bisector so okay now let me take the bisector of let's say this one let's take this one and let us make it the bisector bisector meaning i'm dividing the angle into two equal half so okay now this is the bisector now so let's write down like this and let us name this one okay so let me name it a this is b c and d let me name this as e and this is f let me name this as z let me name as this is h this is i and this is c now solution let us start by writing given what is given is a b and c d are two parallel lines Can you see that A, B, A, B, C, D. These two are two parallel lines. And F, E and F, E intersect A, B and C, D at Z and I respectively. okay now they are intersecting here one point another this one a g and i respectively and z h and i z bisects angle g h this one g is here h is here g h bisects this angle that is b b z i okay angle b z i and let me draw for this one so angle b b z i and j i or i j i j by six i j i j by six this angle c i g or g i c same thing so you can add down let me write down g i c angle g i c this is given okay let us write down to prove what the question is saying is bisector of any pair of alternate angles are parallel so they are telling j i and g h j i and g h these two are parallel so to prove g i g h and j i are parallel okay let us just, uh, let us start our proof for proof let us take different pen let me take the pen as red now okay so let's start so angle b g i and angle this these two angles this angle and this angle are equal why 
because they are alternate angles so angle b z h is equal to angle c i or g i c same thing these two angles are equal multiply by 1 by 2 on both side you can add we know these two are equal and multiply by half on both side so half of angle b z h is equal to half of angle z i c half of angle b b g h b g i this is not h sorry this is b g c b g i sorry b g i this angle right so half of angle b g h half of angle b g h this is the total angle half will be this one because g h is the bisector so this will be the half so you can add on this angle is h g i so you can add on angle angle h z i which will be equal to half of g i c g i c is this angle half i can write down is this angle so it will be j i z or g i j angle g i z okay so these two angles are equal since look here this angle and this angle are alternate angles if this is a line then these two angles will be alternate angles so since since alternate angles are equal since alternate angles are equal therefore i can say gh and ji are parallel okay and hence proved hence proved i hope you understood the concept that's all thank you so much we will meet in the next video